Happy New Year, everybody. And one of the best things about the new year is the January sale currently happening on the PlayStation Store. There are loads of serious discounts here and we advise you to have a good browse yourself. But in the meantime, allow us to draw your attention to some of the best bargains with our list of 10 essential games you can grab for under £10. These are presented in no particular order and in each case we've highlighted when the game leaves the sale. But basically the best idea is to get involved as soon as you can. At 10, we have Batman Arkham City, partly because the chilled streets of Gotham have a wintry New Year feel, and partly because fists. The open world Arkham City refines the flowing combat, engaging, puzzling, and gliding acrobatics of the first Arkham game, which is also available in the sale, and does so while looking great and letting you be Batman. It's among the very best adventures on PS3 and at £9.99 or a pound less for plus subscribers, it's a mad bargain. Grab it before it disappears on the 22nd of January. At 9 we've got the epic space RPG Mass Effect and since we couldn't decide which one we have all three. The first is £3.95, the second and our favourite is £5.39 and they're both available until the 22nd of January. Mass Effect 3 is slightly more but also ridiculously cheap at £6.39 though you have to get in before Wednesday the 8th to grab that. That's a whole lot of shepherding for a smidge over £15. Speaking of amazing things you can do in space, at number 8 we have Dead Space 2, the beefed up action sequel to one of PS3's brightest new series. It has tooled up combat, a killer atmosphere and is available for just £5.39 until the 22nd of January. And if you like it you might also be tempted by Dead Space 3 which goes back to the series chiller roots before doubling down on the action and is on sale for just £6.59. Taking a break from blockbusters just for a moment, at number 7 we've chosen one of 2013's best indie titles. Brothers A Tale of Two Sons features innovative puzzling where you control two characters at the same time, a pair of brothers venturing through a green mountainous land searching for the cure to their father's illness. It's smart, moving and just £3.95 or £3.56 for plus subscribers until the 22nd of January. At number 6 we've got what we reckon is the best entry point if you're still to dive into the genetic time travel of Assassin's Creed, the renaissance set Assassin's Creed 2, starring cheeky Italian stabber Ezio and loads of being on rooftops and sneaking about. It's on sale until the 22nd at a price of £7.36 and plus members get it for £6.22. That's what I call a killing. And that too, that's also a killing. At number 5, a personal favourite of mine which the world didn't fully appreciate first time round, is Mirror's Edge. This unique first person free runner is more about movement than shooting with agility and timing helping you to dash through the bright colours of a dark future with a soaring sense of freedom and just an occasional leg break. As everyone has gradually realised I was right all along, it's slowly become a classic of the PS3 era and you can buy it for a ridiculous £3.99 until the 22nd of January. Next, at number 4, we were in two minds whether to pick the classic, life-consuming racing excellence of Burnout Paradise or the newer, life-consuming racing excellence of Need for Speed Hot Pursuit. Then we thought, they're both produced by brilliant British studio Criterion, they're both a steal at £3.99 and it's our list so we can put them both in if we want. So we did, that's dozens of hours of races, stunts and motor-powered free roaming for under £8, available until the 22nd of January. Horror and shooting arrive at number 3 in the grisly rotten form of zombie sequel Resident Evil 6. It's basically three stories in one, with Chris Redfield, Leon Kennedy and Wesker offspring Jake Muller each having their own campaign with an emphasis on different styles of play that all end up with you shooting dead stuff and being scared. Resi 6 is on sale until the 15th of January at 9 99 or 8 99 for plus subscribers. Looking cheerier at number 2 is the glorious Akami HD, a remake of the gentle PS2 classic that has you playing as a wolf goddess restoring colour to a landscape modelled after a Japanese ink wash painting. There's puzzling, platforming and being hungry because you can't stop thinking that Amaterasu sounds like the name of a really nice pudding and it's all available for the price of £7.80 or £7.02 for plus members until the 15th of January. Finally at number 1, which seems important even though we haven't put the games in any particular order, there's the huge and beautiful Japanese RPG Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. This gorgeous collaboration between animation masters Studio Ghibli and role playing veterans level 5 is basically as good to look at and as fun to play as the billing suggests. 
and offers dozens of hours of entertainment for the tiny price of £6.59 or the even tinier price of £5.93 for Plus members. Nino no Kuni is available on sale until the 22nd of January. Subscribe to PlayStation Access on YouTube for more videos like this one. Leave a comment to tell us what you think and like us, please.